In this quick guide I'm gonna show you how to get plus 3 to stats permanently. Act 3 Baldur's Gate Lower City. Get to the top northwest corner and there's gonna be House of Grief. Go into the House of Grief, complete it however you wish and then go to the very end where Mirror of Loss is going to be located. You can't really miss it as long as you enter House of Grief. Before using the thing try to cast Enhance Ability Intelligence because you're gonna need to pass some checks in order to succeed at getting plus 3. Quick saving and quick loading or saves coming is recommended for this as it is not easy to get it. Upon interacting with the mirror there's gonna be a couple of options, Arcana, Religion and Prayer. Do not use Prayer option. Avoid it, we're gonna use it later. For now either use Arcana or Religion. I've used Arcana, I don't know if Religion offers anything different but I think it doesn't. Both of them are intelligence based skill checks so that's why we have cast Enhanced Ability Intelligence. After passing the check with any of the party members you can leave and then use the mirror with another party member with whom you want to improve the ability. Let me repeat that. You can pass these checks with any of the party members and then leave and then use the mirror again with somebody else. That works. After passing Arcana or Religion check then you need to sacrifice one of the stats in order to potentially gain plus one charisma. This is where saves coming is actually needed. Note that Shadow Heart cannot benefit from ability increase, so you have to use the mirror with someone else. Don't worry about the stats sacrificed because those can be regained easily afterwards. Your goal is to receive a specific response which is going to indicate that plus one charisma has been gained. This is the correct response. You were sure to succeed, Stalemate, but Lord Enver Gortash has stolen your support. All that charming and cajoling in the parlors of the upper city wasted. The memory fades away, yet it leaves its mark on your mind. The dark mirror sees. To remove the debuffs simply cast remove curse or use long rest. Now that we have gained plus one charisma we're gonna use the mirror again. This time we need to pass the prayer check. The huge mirror stares down at you like a great dark eye. By passing the prayer check you can then sacrifice one of the remaining abilities in order to be granted plus two to a chosen ability permanently. Point is that you haven't wasted all the sacrifices from the first attempt to get plus one charisma. There needs to be something remaining, that's why saves coming is required. Anyway, that's all. Years of reading by candlelight dulled your eyesight. Memory fades on the dark mirrors. Hmm. 